Hey friends, this is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead. Well, our one apple tree gave us over a five gallon pail of apples. Only half of them were suitable for eating. The rest went to deer for dehydrating apples. Look, we're doing apples. This is what I got off my one tree. Could you imagine if they all did it? They would if we move them. This is a, these are the last ones. They're the small ones. Briars washed them all up for me. And some of these will go into the compost pail. Um, oh. these. Now, other than the fact that they are spotty, but look, we got a few bumps and spots on them, but aren't they beautiful? These are honey crisp apples, organic and unsprayed. And we are, I've already got my bowl started of uh, water and lemon juice. And we're peeling and slicing apples for the dehydrator. If you're using one of these apple peelers, always put the prongs. This is for new folks. Always put the prongs on the stem end. If you put it on this end and the apple is any, in any way slightly soft, it'll just spin the core, right? This end, the stem end, is the end that is meant to hold weight. So it's the stronger end of the apple. Always put the prongs on the stem end. Okay? Uh-oh. There we go. Put it up your arm again. No, no, it's my shoulder. There's drill on you. Well, if I had one, I would. Where's my drill? I've done it before. I had your mother wearing apple ringlets one day. And one, two, three. Oh, oh sorry, Mom. <laughs> I can remember something. Seriously, they, they got mark they got marks on them, but there's no, absolutely nothing wrong with these apples. All right, so these are the last four trays of my apples. This is the second jar. We want to shake it down. And I better sit down and do this. Now, these, I ended up with just under a half a five gallon pail to go to the deer. The apples were either too small, too damaged, um, or too green, right? But I'm telling you, this five gallon pail, this is apples from my tree, organically raised, unsprayed. So when my grandbaby comes to visit, I will have, hopefully, because I'm afraid I don't eat them, I'm afraid I'll eat them all, we'll have awesome apple snacks for him to chew on. Organic apple snacks. And we just shove these right 
down inside the jar, squishing out as much air as possible. Like if I just lightly stack these in here, I'd probably have four of these jars, but I really pack them down in. Half a five gallon pail, two half gallon jars, or one gallon of apple slices. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our, our half acre homestead saying, not all of my apple trees bloomed, only one did, but I got lots of organic apple slices. Take care, God bless. Remember, every little bit counts.